just enough soft architecture is a great book. It brings several ideas to help you to find the big enemy inside any soft architecture, the complexity. Hello, hello everyone. My name is Otavio Santana and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, a channel that fights against the complexity inside soft architecture. So if you want to know more about how to become more effective and more productive, welcome to the Ultimate Sophisticated Engineer channel. Subscribe to my channel, give the like, put your thoughts, and welcome to the team. Just Enough Soft Architecture is a book that also talks around complexity and how important is fight against this complexity inside our organization, inside our software product. I already discussed a second one that is A Philosophy of Soft Design. It's a great book. Don't worry, I will put the link on the description. And again, it's a book from 2010 and since then it's still I use enemy inside any organization, especially because eventually we're gonna put some new technology because we want you. Sometimes there's no reason for, and you need to fight against two issues. The one is the, the issue that we're supposed to solve, and the another one is because we want to use a technology because we want to use that technology. This book brings weapons to this fight. Passioning, knowledge, and abstraction. Those are based on the risk-driven soft architecture inside the organization. Uh, as I mentioned when we talked about the new Ford books, um, it's everything has a trade-off. It's a law of soft architecture. Please pay attention on it. This book also mentioned the architecture and the language leak. And what does that mean? Especially when we talk about soft architecture, we talk about several aspects inside it where the language does not support. For example, when we talk about Java, we talk about package, but when we talk about soft architecture, we talk about domains, modules, uh, layers, and we don't have layer keywords inside the the Java technology. We don't have the domain keyword inside the la la Java language. Right now it has Java modules, uh, but the point here is it has a lack, a leak between the language, the program language and soft architecture. It's a worth book to bring to get more details. Uh, I really recommend you to pay attention. I enjoy a lot, especially because I'm a big fan of simplicity and be more effective in any kind of software resolution. But I want to know more about you. Did you read the book? What are your thoughts around it? And what was your favorite lesson that you learned from that book? Please give your thoughts, put your comments. And yes, if you enjoy the content, please give your like and subscribe to the channel if you want to become an automated, sophisticated engineer and share with your team, your organization, and so on. That's all for today. Bye.